My name is Thomas and I'm the lead studio painter and product developer here at Army Painter. Hi, uh, my name's Ian and I'm the Chief Marketing Officer for the Army Painter. It was awesome. I like, um, I like the miniatures, they're so detailed, way more detailed than I had imagined uh, before I saw them. And because of the low model count in the game, you can actually spend a lot more time on, on each model. I enjoyed that. It, um, it really suits my approach to painting gaming miniatures. I, I enjoyed it immensely, actually. Uh, what I like about the miniatures is that they've got the right size. Uh, there's a great amount of detail. Uh, and for the paints that we've made for these miniatures, everything seems to, to, to flow together. Uh, so I, I started with a base coat, uh, and then I did a quick highlight, uh, and then I washed it and let it dry. And that wash went into all the recesses, and I picked everything out in black, and I was really impressed. And it only took about an hour per miniature, really. And obviously you can go a bit further if you want to, but I found that was satisfactory just to get uh, ready for gaming. Oh, it was good. Um, like when you guys told us that, that we were up and running in, in 30 minutes, you weren't kidding about that. It was action packed from the beginning. It was awesome. And I'm looking forward to us having a game here uh, at the Army Painter for, for a Friday night. Uh, Bar nights, so <laughs> it's awesome, absolutely. I love it. So uh, I want to play it again. <laughs> uh, what I liked about it is that uh, it's never over to that last dice roll. Uh, so it may look a bit grim if you're, if you're not having the, the throw of the dice, but one one dice roll and everything changes and it flips on ahead. So never give up. Uh, and obviously, when I was playing Thomas in that demo game, uh, we were uh, down to the wire. Uh, and so at the end of that, uh, uh, I was like, right, I want to do it again and I want to do it differently. So yeah, the replayability and you never, it's never over. So that, that was the best thing for it. I think it's a uh, very high quality. Um, I, I think it's impressive. Um, it, it's what I would pick, go and pick up. Uh, not only for painting the miniatures, but the whole gaming experience was uh, above what I uh, absolutely expected. Really good quality. Uh, so everything from the box down to the car components and the board and the miniatures, it's really impressive. Uh, I think there is some uh, ingenuity in, in your layout and your design, and, and you've thought about people that are gonna start from the beginning. Uh, and that's what I really enjoy. I'm, I'm a bit of a rule sieve. I forget it really quickly. And to have that demo mat with all the rules around you, it, it really is really helpful. It stops you flicking through rule books and you know and slowing down the gameplay. Mm -hmm.